Hello, friends and lovers. Welcome back to Tiny Rogues, and it's time to take out the Necromancer. So apparently we got a bunch of skeletal minions. You can see the loadout in the bottom left there with three different skulls. Well, I'll have to see what that looks like exactly. We have Soul Reaper. You and your companions deal 2% increased damage per soul you have. So we're going to try to keep our soul amount up as much as possible throughout the run. It's an intelligence based. Yeah. And the goal is uh, the alignment starts uh, negative one evil. So I guess we'll try to just get a couple more into that just to get the truer ending. I guess best we can. Ooh, nice. Kind of cool looking. Okay. Let's take a look at this stuff real quick. Let's see. Companions Gambit. I don't know why I started. Uh, I decided to start reading the thing on the left. Oh, so this companion is only weighs 0. 0.3. So you can have as many as you want of each out, uh, so to speak. Well, no, you get to pick. You can have up to the weight, basically. Do you want to get more lucky sh shot chance? Do we want to get more critical chance? Or do we want more crushing hit chance? I don't know. This one's melee oriented and the scythe is melee oriented, so. We can have up to three of those skeletons out at once. I don't think it really matters too, too much otherwise. Okay. So this is a good run. It looks to try to go for the achievement where we have at least 10 companions out at once. So I guess that's what I'm, that's what the, the goal besides simply winning, of course, which has almost gotten a bit too easy in some ways. I guess that's what we'll be aiming for. No, there's a secret room. Nothing we can do though. What does this do? Oh, increased companion damage, I just realized. Oh, so even the body armor helps here. Okay. Well, either way, we're losing help. I think I'd rather have the chest and the intelligence at this point, though. What do you got for me? Plus three dex. Okay, that'll do. Ah, we have no gold for the arcade or a bomb. Bad luck. Arcades are great, but not if you have literally zero gold. What can you do, I guess? I think I'll take this next. Let's see. Ah. Let's get a level going on. I don't know. Early on, it's probably better off getting some bombs. Yeah. In hindsight, it's probably you're probably better off getting some bombs and keys. That kind of usually allows you to get more bombs, more keys, etc., etc., etc. Now, I heard from the dev. There's a screenshot from their Twitter page that says Alacrity may or may not be bugged right now, and it's not actually doing anything. So. <laughs> Keep that in mind, I guess. But what we want more than anything is companion stuff, I guess, and especially ways to get more companions. So let's see if we can find something related to that, I guess, huh? What's raised morale exactly? Damage dealt by you and your companions? No. Shock aura? Not really. We got something here. Gain increased stats from your companions based on how many companions you have. Hmm. So. How much do I get if I have more than three companions? Does that mean I should keep rolling here? I guess so. Good question, though. We have all these rolls. I feel like we might as well kind of go for it. Mm, I still see nothing. Come on, help us. Looks like we got nothing here, huh? Hmm. Glass cannon very early. That actually could be kind of interesting in this instance. I think the one we're looking for is red. I'm trying to remember. There's some, yeah, it's like some, some, something that it gives you more companion load, basically. Huh. It's either poison aura. What does our equipment load look like right now? We cut it in half. It's not too much. Hmm. Crushing shot chance. Does that help our companion damage? It does not. You know what? Let's go poison aura then, I think. Since apparently it's supposed to give the companions poison aura too, is that isn't that what that said? Hmm. Debuffs enemies to take poison damage from you and your companions. Oh, okay. So the companions deal poison damage as well, I guess. Okay. I guess I understand, right? All right. Let's finally get some keys going on here. Okay. I'm off to a slow start. It's okay. We're getting there though. A melee weapon. Let's just get another charm here, I guess. Avoid the curse. A little bit. Oh-ho! Go, my companions. Not so bad. The companions actually were bopping pretty good there, too, right? So right now... Oh, right. We already have plus on the crushing hit, crushing hit chance. So I kind of didn't want that thing I was looking at already. Ugh, magic damage. No? 
Increased orbital sway range. That's really bad. <laughs> plus three int, plus 10% crit chance. Ooh. I think I'll just take the intelligence just because the accessory slot is pretty prized and I'll probably end up replacing that ring pretty quickly if I were to guess, right? So I think this is fine because it's hard to get much better charms. All right, remember, we don't want to spend souls. I also want to gain souls as much as we can, right? We get more damage for the souls we have. Forgive me if my voice is a bit off. I don't know if it's dust or allergies or a combo of everything. I've been sneezing like a, like a, what's something that sneezes? Lucky hits with this weapon roll plus one additional time for critical hits. Very short. Remember we actually, I need some spear thing too. Some spear, uh, da, 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 achievement. A magic sword is kind of interesting for us. Chrono staff short hmm potent twin daggers runic sword checking the scaling here what do we have for staties again here we have no strength i'm worried about the i don't think i'm really gonna want to use these daggers but maybe i'll try do 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 I know I'm using the melee skeletons, but I might not, I might not stick to that, you know? We might not stick to that forever. Curse broccoli, but plus three. Ah, I think you gotta do it, right? Remember, we're trying to go for evil, so uh, we gotta keep that in mind as we go. We wanna go to the black market and spend money with the black market and stuff. We need more bombs. Okay. Another plus three on the broccoli. Damn, it's a lot of decks really quickly, huh? Can't turn that down. Okay. So do I actually want to look at more companions? Because it just kind of doesn't matter. It feels like a no, right? Do I roll these now? We don't really want to change the body armor. I guess I'll look at accessories. I was kind of open for like guaranteed rares or something there. What can you do though? Aho! Do, 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 do. So I might try to avoid spending money at the evil shop. The goal is to simply have 10 companions before you beat death. And I get credit for beating the run once death is over. So I'm not going to go crazy far out of the way to make sure we get to the final boss in hell, basically, is what I'm saying. My entire floor makes the rewards offered after defeating the boss after offer plus one choice that is very peculiar uh particular so no <laughs> non-triggered lucky hits a trigger an elemental burst blah 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 maybe accessory gain plus one suppression grants 10 percent increased melee damage per suppression you have eh? i guess hmm Quaddle gloves huh we don't really have anything to do with lucky hit chance. We could swap out and put on three of these skeletons. Would that be better? Maybe. Each skeleton mage grants plus 5% lucky hit chance. Okay. I guess. Hmm. Interesting. I guess I've taken more decks over some booze right now. All right, we're going. Do, 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 do. All right, and show us companion stuff. I know I spent like all my rolls earlier. Oh no! Nothing companion related, huh? Periodically mark the lowest health enemy. They're all, they're all dex based too. What's the deal with that? I don't really like spinning blades. Crit multiplier doesn't make a ton of sense for us, so I feel like it kind of just has to be rogues reliability. Hmm, Rogue's Mark is a mark that guarantees a critical hit and grants Rogue's Reward. Just gives you more crit chance, basically. True, I have no keys, but I feel like I gotta almost move away from all the decks they've given us. Push it back into the... the magic here. Uh... Yeah, I don't, I don't know if it's worth looking at uncommon weapons that badly. 
Our current weapon's uncommon, and it's fine. Seems to be doing the trick, right? So I can sell some of our skellies. I don't really want more curse. I kind of... I think I'm going this way just to kind of sell this for one gold. <laughs> Step one. And I guess that's about it. Late Tavern. So I can't buy this because that'll turn us good. Hmm. We do have one curse. There's no black market here. The best I can do is like buy some bombs or something now, right? Seems like a no. See some souls to gain some damage, I guess. I'm going to skip the shop just because we don't have that much money. Trying to keep up with it. Even that soul place. Try to catch a fish. A bite. Uh, crap, I forget. It took me a second. We did it. What do we got? We got a lobster. What does that do? It's just a buff that lasts for... Oh, 20 rooms. Damn, okay. Longer than I thought. I think they let you do this more than once. A bite. Come on, go, go, go. Even better. Dispels one stack of curse. Oh, perfect, actually. How much do you let you fish here? Oh, no, what happened? Oh, I may have gotten overzealous. Okay, now the rod's gone. Okay. I don't know if it's because I hit some buttons too early, like I was pre prepping for it. <laughs> Range weapon or another charm? Wow, they're really pushing that stuff. I'm trying to avoid the curse a little bit. Go! Okay, that's one, baby. Now I'm getting sucked in. That's two, baby. Okay. We got 40 soul now. 40. 40 of it. Boom. Boom. Apparently that's lucky. 50% increased effect of taunt. That's useless. On dash gain tiny dancer. Grants you 10 a dex. Ugh. Offhand. Grants a charming orbital. And what's that? Plus one heart. God, these are so lame. <laughs> Where's all the companion stuff? I guess I'd just take the heart charm. We're kind of low on that kind of stuff anyway. That's the way I'm looking at it. All right, I got to replace the battery in my headset. Don't let anything bad happen. Don't worry, I can play at the same time. Ooh, a lollipop. That's going to be nice, actually. Okay, let's go. Oh, no. My hand's not on the controller properly, and they had to give me this guy. Ah! I thought I could one-hand it. Oh, my God. How could this happen? Okay, I'm okay. That was really bad, though. Give me that. All right, rare weapons we will look at, of course. What are our stats kind of telling us right now? Dex and intelligence. By far. The happy icicle tome. A lot of lucky hit stuff. That's pretty good. That's pretty, pretty good. Okay. This weapon inflicts maximum stacks of poison with critical hits. That's not good, probably, because we get poison from other sources already. Like, it doesn't multiply poison damage or anything like that, right? Hmm... More poison crap. Chakrams. Uh, this actually has mana drain, interestingly, huh? Kind of feels like it's the tome, though. Because that has lucky hit chance and also applies the freeze. That's what it seems like to me. Oh, it's one of these weapons. Okay. I think I'm actually going to do the consumables here. One of these weird weapons. So they kind of got to be within range for this to work properly. Oh my god. Ooh, plus five XP, baby. Let's go. Shazam. That's lucky. All right, familiar, familiar. Well, this does give us a familiar. It do be giving us a familiar. An arcade familiar companion. Attacks one time, blah, blah, blah. Familiar grants negative 25% mana drain threshold. It's something. It's something. All right. I'll take that soul heart too. Definitely give me the event. What is this chamber? 
Well, there's a switch. Pull the lever. Oh, that scared me. I was like, what's, what's happening? Okay, they're just giving us stuff, apparently. Okay. The trash sniper rifle. No. Trash tornado wand. No. And energy saber. That one kind of sounds fun, to be honest. Uh, They're all trash, obviously. This one actually has mana drain. I don't think we're using any of these either way. I will take the soul heart. Uh, I could sell that, but that's like the only thing to sell. I think I'll just take the soul heart here, honestly. You don't really have a lot of mana to work with here. I don't think I want to invest in these yet. At all. <laughs> So right now we should have four companions for us. So we're on our way, but there's a lot more to go. We do have keys. I do have some money. Our weapon's okay. I think I can visit the shop. Ah, it's crystal crap. Not exactly what I'm hoping for. The crystal ring, crystal projectiles inflict vulnerability. No? I'm triggering a crystal effect, blah, blah, blah. These are so hard to get going. On dash, shoot five homing crystal projectiles or whatever. Sure, I'll take that one. It didn't wait. It doesn't weigh too much, does it? No, it doesn't. Okay. Does that mean I should take another crystal thing? <laughs> Gain crystal surge grants 50% increased primary attack damage. Okay, I mean, is it now the day for the crystals? Has it arrived? I find it unlikely, but... Who knows? Maybe, maybe it's good. Maybe I've been missing out. Okay, so are there enemies? Okay, thank you. So all companions is still bad, right? Stop offering me charms. Like, what's going on? All rare is fine. Okay, bud. Shambler easy, right? Here, make sure you get the poison off. Okay, wait for the mana to come back. Okay, buddy. That was very close. Okay, I couldn't really see, but it worked. <laughs> More souls! So how much damage does it, do we have, does it say over here? 100% and there's no cap, it would appear. Hmm, interesting. Ooh, that armor of favor is quite strong. We lose out on this uh, companion stuff. Fire element is pretty bad. Your mana star buff effect digitally grants 25% chance for magic attacks to repeat. That's okay. We have 40% lucky hit chance. Why is that again? Where'd I get all that? Oh, it's from the weapon, I think. Yeah, it's from the weapon. Hmm. Is it this? Plus one mana is very good. Oh, it weighs a ton. Crap. Just realized. Do we have rolls? We do have rolls. Is it worth rolling? I don't know. Maybe. I'm looking for anything that mentions companions, basically, too. I wonder if I should also use this obsidian dice on our second trait here. Rogue's Mark. Ooh, we got a lucky epic. Hmm. Grant plus 10 maximum stacks of poison. They really want me to put, put out that poison today, huh? Yeah, these are actually not... That good, I feel, especially since I bought two things that are crystal related. Ooh, plus two mana, though. Yes? Now that I like. That I like. Okay. We'll walk through the evil shop, but I really should not spend any souls. Increased attack speed. Oh, but look at it. While evil, your primary attacks inflict a doom. Oh, but look at it. Is that better? That's probably better, right? Nothing to do with uh, companions. It's probably better. Um, is it not? There's no cap, right? 2%, yeah. These are legendary gloves. They weigh 15, so we won't be overburdened or anything like that. I mean, our current gloves aren't that bad, to be honest. They're not that bad. Hmm... I have 
have to actually be full evil, which means that's actually not going to work yet. So if I buy this, I kind of just got to hold on to it. Actually. Ah. It's so good. I'm pretty sure it's so good. Alignment is leaning evil. Yeah, so we have to just get to three evil, and then we can actually make use of it. They're making it hard on me out here, you know what I mean? More souls. Bring it back. Oh, but Cursed Burger. More souls. Bring it back. We'll be fine. We got that plus 5 XP from that item, so we're probably kind of ahead in a sense. Come on, companions. Take care of business. Uh, give me the intelligence now. Oh, my God. And here are the crystals actually popping when I when I dash, interestingly. I only got one key. I don't think it's that big of a deal if I do that. Do do do. Come on, die. Pawn shop again. I guess. So many pawn chops, it feels. Sell that, sell this stupid thing. I think it's safe to say I can sell these daggers. They weren't that bad, I'll admit, though. Uh, do I want to sell one of these? Maybe the crit one? Maybe the melee one, in a sense? Should probably get rid of one. It's hard for me to tell there. What is this? Permanently grants a green spice on consumption. Poison infusion buff that permanently grants 20 to 30 poison damage. These are incredibly expensive. Especially the blue spice. What's the deal with that? Fire damage. I've never seen this shop. It's actually pretty cool. I just bought the cheapest one, honestly. Now we have like a few different debuffs going on. We got ice from the weapon, fire from the infusion, poison from our aura. Kind of badass, you know? Blade summon tome. Seems like a big new to me. I could look at it. Ah, bloody chest. You do need a key, don't you? No, it just says cost health. Never mind. We'll be fine, right? I think I may have just lost a soul heart. Ooh. Ow. Plus one block. All right, I guess. I think we still take the dice here. Especially since they could give us ethereal dice. I don't think they did, though. Booties or an accessory. I think we have... Yeah, we got some rolls now. Ranged weapon, accessory, set item, melee item. Ugh. What is going on today? Where's all the companion stuff? Oh, uh, I almost forgot what enemy this was. Or rather, I did. Do-do-do-do-do-do-do. Good night, Sphinx. We're still doing okay. So to get one more evil, I think the best... Uh, the only way off the top of my head besides spending more souls is uh, visiting the black market. That's all I can think of. Plus 50 equip load capacity. Ugh. No drizzle thing, no. While your equip load is at half or below your equip load capacity, gain 50% increased stamina. No. Charms all enemies in the room every 10 seconds. What? What, what is this? Why are these so bad? <laughs> what else he got? Companion. Companion. Say something about companions. At least we got a helmet offered here. Plus one suppression. 10% increased fire damage. That's not very good. Hmm. 20% increased damage dealt to chilled enemies. That's okay. Plus one evade. Uh, I guess I'm taking flare specs here. Because they look cool mostly, you know? Alright. So we're still not even enough, evil enough to wear the gloves. I'm not going to actually spend souls here. We'll take some soul hearts. Looks like I lost another soul heart. Okay. Come on, dude. My god, that is scary. Epic weapons, please. I don't know what I'm pleasing for, but something. Explosion damage. 
Scales mostly with intelligence. We have a high, a decent amount of decks. Ah, so the potent E piano plus two sounds all right. While standing still, you have double the attack speed. I think I might have tried this and it was kind of rough. Shadow Grasp Tomes. Weapon has a 100% cursed hit chance. It's kind of not what we're going for. The Abyssal Bible plus one. So this is probably an orbital, right? Yeah, it is. Curse hits with a weapon. Summon an Abyssal Wraith Companion that lasts for four seconds. Abyssal Wraiths attack two times per second, dealing blah, blah, blah. Each Wraith grants plus 5% critical hit chance. Uh, so I guess it has to be this, huh? <laughs> so it's kind of another Bible run in a sense. I mean, it's definitely... It definitely sounds pretty cool. Oh, you get three of them, too. Hmm. Okay, we're gonna try. So I need to go for cursed hits now. It would appear. Right? There we go, that's one. Poison Sickles, Cultist Sickles. I don't think there is a good reason to read those. Oh, I don't have a bomb for that. Damn, son. I've been really just short on that stuff this run for some reason. I ain't been getting it. I just want everything and I never have everything. Ooh. What is that? So I actually have three things to sell right now, huh? Hmm. Um, give me the bombs. I don't know. Give me the bombs. I mean, I would have to take damage to get in there. Is sort of what I'm thinking. Tavern. Uh, there's a chance of black markets there, so I kind of have to go. Crap, it's not here. This doesn't, like, cause any problems, right? It does not. All right. I think if you buy super illegal gun parts, actually, that helps with the evil. But it's very expensive. And obviously not very useful all the time. Got an XP shard. Okay. We have no armor to repair. I don't know if I'm really sticking to this weapon or not. Kind of broke after that. Then I guess I'm leaving. Okay. Boom, boom, boom. Oh, oh, oh. What do we got? Comeback blessing. Try and satisfy that on completing a combat encounter without taking damage recovers one heart and lasts for one floor. That's like... Useless, isn't it? That's pretty bad, right? I'm not crazy, right? It's bad, right? You know what? Give me the... Give me this over the beef, I think. Do -do -bum -bum. Accessory, more companions. Do we have any rolls? We do not have any rolls for this. Okay, I guess I'm gonna look at... Yeah, I don't want all companions. These... I don't know. There might be lighter companions than these skeletons, but... I am not aware of them if there are. Why, Kraken? Gotcha. Okay. I can't really see the skeletons we're supposedly summoning from our hits. Or at least I haven't really known. Oh, wait. We have to get cursed hits for that to even happen. They last for four seconds as a point one second cooldown. So we're looking for ways to get cursed hits now. Oh, crap. I got. I may have skipped some cursed hit chance then. Adds your invincibility duration after taking damage to the duration of your status effects. Ugh. What else we got? <laughs> Plus one stamina. No, 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 no. Lightning ailment. No, 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 no. Each point of dexterity additionally grants 1.5% chance to repeat attacks. Does that even work with this stuff? I feel like it doesn't. That's too bad. Some of this stuff was kind of cool looking. I don't know if I really care about adding poison damage. I'd prefer the enemies just die quickly, you know? <laughs> Boom. 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 Is that a luck ring? Maybe. Plus one luck accessory. I'd probably rather have that, yeah. We can't take the burn stuff, but right now our, yeah, our body gives us plus two mana. It's just not worth it. Not at all. New helmet. 
Oh, increased damage, but re oh, reduces companion damage by 30%. Oh, so it's the opposite of what we want in some ways. So no. Yeah, I definitely prefer that. Let's go ahead and uh, drop something, would ya? Are we really going to use the crit stuff at this point? What do you do? You give us lucky hit chance? Yeah, I think that's fine. Okay, let's go. Does lucky hit chance ruin cursed hit chance? Hmm. Hmm. Not really sure how that works, to be honest. Intelligence! Uh oh. Do, do, do. Alright, companion, 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 companions. Come on. Ugh. I only have five burn ticks on an enemy, or when a burning enemy dies, trigger a fiery burst. 100% eh. increased stats granted by mana to mana draining weapons. Well, I think it's insight, right? Salad. Get out of here. I don't really want a set item that badly. Oh, okay, that was my fault. Oh, and I didn't have stamina for the second one. That's not my fault. The second one's not my fault. <laughs> the flare mantle's back. Yeah, I'm still not going to be using it. Probably worth more than that weapon if I were to guess. Give me the money? Okay, we're good. I'll take the alchemy stash. Doo -doo -doo. And a potion. Okay, we got some cool stuff. So that's a mana potion. Power potion. Anger potion. And another mana potion. We're still not evil enough for these gloves. And drop those sickles, right? We're not evil enough. To the shop now, I think. Shock wand, dragon scale armor, battle axe, red hoodie. On defeating a boss without taking damage, you are granted an additional strength pickup. Hmm, no thanks. Take the event. That's a lot of potions. Is that is that all? We, is that everything here? Because I have like all these potions effects already, don't I? Except the wrath, maybe. <laughs> but that doesn't feel very good. Okay, well then, whatever, I guess. <laughs> so, okay, I guess we, we start going for Curse, right? On purpose, although we're on floor 7. It's gonna be a bit tough to potentially get the Curse up and running. Yeah, I'll, I'll accept some armor. I hope I didn't forget and skip some Curse Chambers after we took this weapon. I kind of can't remember now. It's all a blur, baby. Rare items is pretty nice, but at the same time, I kind of just don't have an offhand. I only got one key, so I think I'm okay with just going this way. Come here, bud. One. Okay, stamina. Uh, mana looks fine. What in the blue heaven? Ah, where's my stamp? Okay, that was brutal, huh? <laughs> Not killing them fast enough, I guess. We really need to get one more evil. So if we get an evil shop, we're probably just going to have to spend. Periodically triggers icicles to fall. Yeah. Thrusting damage. Yeah. Another offhand. 30% increased move speed. Pops a balloon when taking damage. Damn. That would be nice if they didn't get ruined. <laughs> oh, this has weight? Oh, crap. I guess I am taking balloon bundle for now, then. Feels a little bit nicer, at least, right? The good shop. No, thank you. You could walk through there, but I'll just get tempted and it'll be a whole thing, you know? Give me the intelligence. Whoa, my friends. Okay, yes. Boom, 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 boom. Unfortunately, I feel like we haven't been super lucky with the companion keywords still. I was really hoping for a bit more. Yeah, 
This didn't line up, I guess, right? Ah, come here! Die! I have no bombs to go to the pawn shop. Crap. Doesn't that stink? Doo doo. Gold pine resin. Okay. Still got a while on those potions. Gonna use that. Dragon slayer weapon? No, I'm gonna say no. We're kind of semi stuck with this weapon to some degree, probably now. I mean, I've only taken one curse, so I guess I'm not. But I don't know. I kind of feel like it's a good, decent one to invest in. Yeah, we'll go this way. We can afford one upgrade, and then we go to shopping. No. Cheap costume. Grants plus one maximum companions, but you deal 50% less damage. Ah, uh, well, I guess we have to. <laughs> I guess we gotta. I can afford that, right? Oh my god, just barely. And no to the other crap. I guess we gotta, uh... I can barely put it on. Okay. So, get out more skellies. Is that... I got them all out, right? There we go. Uh, I guess we're going for the alchemy stash here, huh? So, I deal less damage. Companions... Don't deal more damage. Okay, please stop hitting me. But I can just have a lot more of them. Sorry, the inventory management has been a huge pain today. Do do. Helmet? Yeah, a new helmet. If anything here, right? We only have two obsidian dice. We could roll the rogue thing. I guess I will? Just see if we get lucky early here. I don't really know what's making me wait. Each point of mana additionally grants 20% more top end damage to mana draining weapons. The thing is, I only have two mana. So I don't know if that's very interesting, to be honest. Oh man, you scared me. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. I kind of failed miserably there. It was just a bad day, basically. <laughs> I have no flasks. I have one health. Ugh. I don't know. I don't know why it, it feels so different, you know? Sometimes. Sometimes it's just tougher. Yeah, the crystal greaves aren't good. I will probably just take those. Plus 20 dexterity, though. On non-triggered lucky hit. <sighs> Affects attack speed and a move speed. That is a lot of dexterity. Do I have to take the evade here, though? I'm probably just going to do a full recover on the next floor, which means spending souls, right? I think that's kind of what we have to do. We lost our balloons, too. I know. Goodbye, dex. If I could get to 50 dex before death, that's another achievement, but we're I think we're kind of too far still. I think. Okay. It's going to be different this time. Yeah, we're going to have to do the full recover here. Gives us our health and our flask back. Okay. Back at it. Go, my companions. Look at them go. Epic weapons. Now, nah, I guess I'm skipping them. I don't know. Maybe that's stupid, but... Show me a black market in here. Please stop. Please go away. Please die. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm not scared. Hey, it's a black market. Oh, thank God. This is going to be huge. So A, we go evil. What does this do again? Primary attacks inflict the doom. I kind of forgot about this, to be honest, too. And so, good thing we didn't take those dex gloves, basically, right? Remember to keep the companion. Don't mess that up. We just get so much money from doing this. Alright, so more companions aren't going to help unless they weigh somehow less than the skeletons. Critical hit, damn it. No critical hit chance, no. Mana star, no. 
That's an uncommon companion. It still weighs one, so no. Plus one dex. Hmm. Wizard cloak, no. Five gold for that is fine. What do you got for us? Please help. Hmm. On a lucky hit, gain cheap shot, increase in secondary crap. No. Pick up a mana star, three meteors drop from the sky. So basically, none of these really help. Hmm. Maybe Apocalypse just to be a little bit different. Maybe I've been missing out. We got the Snow Launcher. That's still not very good for us here. So we're evil enough now. We're fine. I have nothing to sell, right? This is not attuned yet. That's okay, though. So yeah, I guess we're done here. We need more intelligence. The only way to potentially get enough companions at this rate is probably if I summon a ton with our weapon somehow. By having a lot of curse chance, right? I think I took lost a bunch of hits there too. Jeez. I think I definitely took some hits. Whoa. Maybe it's just me today. <laughs> I feel like I don't usually struggle so much. Clockwork boots, no. Disenchanting death sickles plus one. Ooh, that scaling. That's a legendary, baby. That's a legendary. This weapon gains plus one percent crit chance per soul you have. Baby, baby, baby. It's not a magic weapon, but that's okay, because I kind of get ditched all our mana anyway. Oh, but, 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 we kind of, we kind of, sa we're sacrificing it all for the companions, you know? No. No, it's so good, though. But it's so good. Give it to me. Oh, crap, I forgot to sell the Happy Ice Cold Tome when we were over there. Probably another mistake for me. These are the sickles? Okay. They're probably good for now. And then, I don't know, I guess for death, we just got to put the Bible back on or something like that. Hmm. Okay. We are at least partially evil. We could enchant the Bible. I don't know how helpful that is, though. We got the blacksmith over there to upgrade some stuff. So I'm looking to gain curse still. So, none of this is going to help us do that. I'd probably rather just go this way. I guess I'm going to upgrade the Bible. I think I take the money over the set item stash, but I am going to use the sickles for now, potentially here. And I'm going to focus, and I'm not going to get hit. Not one bit. Okay. Okay. Ugh. What do our boots do again? They give us evade. I don't know if looking at companions was really going to help us at all. This is just at least one pair of boots, right? I hate this boss because it jumps in the air and you can't hit him. Like this. Like a jerk. Like a wallaby. Like a wallaby. Like a wallaby. Oh, I think I took a hit. You're the worst, King Ooze. Oh, crumb buckets. Okay, that time was my fault. I was very, very close. Admittedly, we've we've kind of fallen from grace a bit here. <laughs> Things just aren't popping as much, right? Another flare robe. Stop. But stop. We can't do it. Grants plus 20% critical hit chance to weapons that upgrade level 4 and higher. So, no. That's a new... What's worth more? Rare or set items? I don't even know. Maybe they'll stop offering me flare mantles if I have one in my inventory, though. That's my hope, at least now. A tune. There's some curse from an alchemy stash. Wow. Oh my god, there goes a block. Oh my god. 
Is the Bible better here for me? What a nightmare this has been. Agility potion. Power potion. Maybe I gotta swap back to this. Is this just performing better for us? I'm not so sure. Companion's not really working out for us yet. I have no key for that. You gotta be kidding. I'm trying to gain a level here, so I think I'm gonna go for this. Our quip live sucks too while we're at it. Wait a minute. Why aren't our primary attacks dealing doom damage? It says we're evil. While evil, your primary attacks inflict doom. It says negative three. Huh. I don't think they're inflicting doom damage. Uh, I don't see doom. It's usually, it's like a skull icon. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's not working. Should I check with the other weapon? Got to read it again. Your companions grant no stats, but you can have plus two companions. Ugh, all right, baby. Okay. <laughs> Worth. I have no keys. Uh, should I check the other weapon? Each rate, gr each rate grants a 0% critical hit chance now from the Abyssal Bible. And I have enough skeletons where I don't need to use that anymore. Right? So I guess I should be sickling it up. Right? We got the max level, barely. Ah, oh, come on, man. Come on, man. Some res. That's a mimic, so we'll go this way. All right. Thank you, companions. What is that? What are these? Some offhands. Grants 10% increased movement speed per curse you have. Apparently, we have four curse. Damn, that went up quick. Move speed or evade. I don't know. Wasn't there something else? Oh, yeah, I put on an offhand, I guess. It weighs too much, though. Damn. Yeah, we don't want to be encumbered, I don't think. Refill flask. Yeah, refills hearts and flasks, actually. I need it. <laughs> do, 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 do. Thank you, game. You're very kind of you. This way I don't have to spend anything here. Am I still going to go this way for all the curse? You know what? I'll still use the Bible in this instance to get maximum amount of companions going. Sound good? Go, my necromancers! Ah, oh, I already took a hit. I think when I use orbitals, I tend to want to stare at stare and make sure that orbitals are doing something, you know? Okay, that's one. That's one, baby. Instead of staring at the proper thing, which is making sure I don't get hit. I'm just saying. Look at the mages! Look at them go! Okay, that was very scary. Woo -hoo -hoo. In it to win it! Oh, I got my achievement too. Help of my little friends, it was called. All right, so the main goal of the run is complete now, at least. <laughs> but we'll see if we can get through the rest. On non-triggered lucky hits, blah, 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 blah. We have very... Oh, I thought I had very... Oh, when, where do I get lucky hit chance? Oh, I think it's from a weapon that I don't have anymore. So yeah, those are not good. Actually, it might be the best thing here still. We'll see. The Aegis. Self-repairs armor on completing an encounter room. Oh, that is amazing if I can actually ever... I just need one more strength, but I don't know if that's going to happen. Maybe it's actually okay to put on now anyway. When you're encumbered, top end damage, critical chance, penalty, blah, 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 blah. Nothing to do with companions, interestingly. 
Isn't that fascinating? Oh, but I need the Bible on to actually have an offhand. An offhand. Ugh. Wait, why did I drop that? Okay, I guess. Maybe somehow I can get strength. I'm not so certain, really. Realistically, though, right? To the burning hells. Let's go. Let's see. A tune. Plus one to the highest attribute, which is intelligence. Hmm. We survive long enough that hopefully the companions will take care of it. I can't believe that hit me, by the way. More stuff hit me after that, too. Age is self-repaired, though. We're fine. <laughs> do I go for a key over critical hit multiply? I think I do. In this instance. Okay. Oh, come on. Everything hurts. Hey, where where's my Aegis my Aegis tick here? Huh. I thought I even saw it say it. I'm watching very intently. Is it the aura that's distracting me? I don't know. I'm trying to determine what it is. Is it just because things aren't dying quickly enough for my taste? Tequila? I'm just full of excuses, that's the truth. everyone's fault but by own no set items right okay there are ways to get more companions but i gotta say it's been a bit lackluster right can we agree it's just not it's just not the same random tomes sure more curse Especially, like, we had to sacrifice getting stats from the companions in order to get more of them. And it's just not... It doesn't feel like it's worth it, right? On draining a cumulative amount of mana, trigger unpredictable sparks. So I can replace something with that. Hmm. I don't know what I do here. We don't, we only have two mana, which is very, very low. I guess I'll take the equip load here. Oh, actually, yeah, that works. I forgot you could find equip load over strength. We're good. Okay, my companions do not want to do anything. Ah, thank you. Okay, so now we're no longer encumbered. We should not be, at least. Lovely. That's a soul shop. Which makes us lose some stuff here. So I lose my offhand if I... Yeah. I should probably buy that. That's probably worth it. Lightning Staff. Occult Mark. On draining an accumulated amount of mana. Plus 17 souls. I mean, our current is pretty bad. Pixie Dust, huh? Plus one evil. I'm not going to think about the trade. I just don't think it would be super important. Oh, I can't use it. Apparently our weapon's high enough. Hmm. This definitely makes things more interesting. I think I'll put it on. Hmm. Mm hmm. Mana drain refund. I kind of actually need it probably. Actually, wouldn't that have anti-synergy with our with our head thing? Do 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 do. Does this game need a DPS meter in some way, maybe? Do it. Uh more move speed per curse, huh? Wonder if that's actually better. Oh, it weighs too much. Kinda weighs too much. Huh. I'm still not going to spend here, though. I'm stingy like that. What can I tell you? All right, let's just go this way. All right, Dragon Boy, whatever your name is. My companions will have you.
Okay, just making sure I don't get hit, step one. I know, like, I'm, I'm not doing much to it. <laughs> what can you do, though? Okay. Oh, come on. Start spinning up, baby. I like this move because it's so freaking easy. Is it me or is that move like so freaking easy? Come on, bud. I wonder what we were missing in this, right? I know there's, hmm. There's some, there's some kind of trait that is supposed to help. I think I could technically get in there during this, but. Are you up here? You are. Uh-oh. 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 I got, I used my res. Yo, I got nothing. <laughs> okay. <laughs> we got cursed a lot at the end there. Oh, I gave it my all. I gave it my all. A bunch of companions. I did try. We did try. It was goofy fun, I think. Uh, the companions kind of follow you a bit too tightly, perhaps, though. But we got our achievement. I am pleased with it, at least. So far, I don't know. Maybe there's something else that could kind of push you to want companions harder than what uh, what we had there. Maybe there's a different trait that's like, okay, this is the one that we want. But that was that's the class for companions, it looks to me, right? Okay. Well, we did our best and it was fun. Thank you so much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.